my daughter's gone and nobody knows where she is. Pete Jenkins hasn't seen his daughter in seven months. He says distance and losing touch are to blame. Now, no one's seen Jessica in more than two weeks. I just want her back. That's, that's all. That's what we both want. We just, well, everybody wants that. Police say Jessica was abducted while working at this Norton Shores gas station. Pete says he didn't know she was working there alone. It pisses me off, you know. There should have been somebody there with her. She, she worked here in Sparta at a gas station. Never alone. And yeah, she was never, never alone. Jessica lived with Pete and his wife, Christina, from ages 12 to 17, then moved back in when she found out she was pregnant with Zevin, a special time for Pete and Christina. Going to doctor's appointments with her and stuff, you know, and being there when the baby was born is, is great. Pete says Jessica gets her love for music, especially the Beatles, from him. He says this room makes him feel closer to her. I feel helpless. My hands are tied. I can't do a damn thing. But he has hope the right tip will come in soon. I want all the tips checked out, checked out you know, and keep coming. I want, I want her face to still be out the news. He's met with the investigation team that's working around the clock to bring her home, and he's in constant communication with them, hanging on every new development. I can't thank him enough. Now they're hoping and praying that Jessica and Zevin will soon join them on this couch, just like they used to. Jessie's a little fighter. She's not, you know, I mean, she's a fighter. If she can get out of what she's in, she will definitely get out of it. And that's what we're holding on to now. I'm trying not to give up hope, and I'm scared to death.